first road trip for the day. My mom, she's driving us. For those of you that read my blog, you would have seen that a couple weeks ago I posted about my favorite book. It's written by Miranda Kerr, one of my all-time favorite models. And today, my positive affirmation is... Also, forgot to tell you guys that I have braces behind my teeth, so I might sound a little bit silly now and then. So we're here at Allen Hospital. I'm getting ready to donate some blankets as part of my project, Cuddle for a Cure. It's a nonprofit that I created in memory of my friend Grant, who passed away with a brain tumor in 2013. But it is my ultimate favorite way to give back and I've now donated 206 blankets with the help of people from my community. Guess where we are? Fun fact, my cousin Carter plays football in here, and my family loves to come and watch him. So I love guacamole. Ask me what I'm majoring here next year at UNI. I just changed to public relations and I've changed my mind like a billion times. We're so full and now we're on our way back home. Hey guys, I'm back home now and I'm waiting for my brother to get home from baseball practice and then we're going to head to my grandpa and grandma's farm. So I've been asked quite a few times who my roommate is for Miss Teen USA, and it is Paige Matheson from North Dakota. Another question I've been asked a couple times is which Miss Universe and Miss USA do I idolize? It'd have to be Olivia Culpo both times. When Olivia Culpo competed for Miss USA, I watched her on TV. That was the first Miss USA pageant I ever watched, and I loved her. I love this question, so thank you. To me, being confidently beautiful is just finding your passion and doing something that you love. Because I'm a first class believer that happy girls are the prettiest girls. Shout out to my girls from Sumner, Iowa for the question. I love elephants, they're my favorite, but I'd love to be a bird so that I can transport super fast. Welcome to Iowa. Yes, this is all corn behind me. Is it really Iowa if you don't Snapchat about the corn? Actually, my grandpa and grandma have owned a sweet corn business for over 45 years, and that's been my summer job ever since I was little. So I'm paying for my college tuition and Miss Teen USA by selling corn out of the back of a truck. Now we're in Nashville, Iowa. We're at a local festival and we're getting ready to do something really fun, so stay tuned. This is my best friend Haley. She's 
she decided to wake up, guys. We're getting nervous because the first thing you have to do is jump in a big pool of cold, freezing water. Workout number two in the books. Yeah. I had a question come in from Sarah. She asked if this is my hometown, and it's actually not, but it's really near, and my mom grew up here. Finally, finding some time to sit down and answer a few questions. I got asked how Scott Keppel trains me when he's in Arizona and I'm in Iowa. Actually, he trains me all online. He sends me my workouts, and he trusts that I do them all on my own, and I do. It's awesome. I just ask him any questions I have about my diet or exercises, anything. Honestly, Scott is awesome. He's awesome. I wouldn't change trainers in my entire life. I have to answer this one. No, I've never had a flat tire and I don't know how to change one. I've had so many questions on what is my favorite food. Let me think about that for a second. Okay, seriously though, there aren't many foods that I don't like, but my all time favorite is tart frozen yogurt topped with lots of fruit. So I saved this one for last because it's my favorite. Tanisha from Colorado asked, what advice do you have for a girl who's very self-conscious about herself? This one really hits home for me because I, I really went through it. And that's the whole reason that I started my blog, Beautiful and Berries. My biggest advice for you would be just to find something that makes you feel so good inside and makes you so proud to be yourself. And for me, that's actually been pageant. So I'm so thankful to be here as your Miss Iowa Teen USA. It's been a long road, but look where I am now. Thank you so much for the great day, Snapchat. I've had so much fun showing you around Iowa and answering all your questions. 